internet browser and in the URL bar, type in 192.168.1.254 unless you have changed the default IP address and press the enter button on the keyboard. Click on sign in at the top right of the page to log in. In the user field, enter advanced user and in the password field, enter the code found on the label attached to the bottom of the modem, marked as access key. Click on sign in to log in. Instead of sign in at the top right, you should now see advanced user to confirm that you have logged in with the correct account. Click on the when services card. Click on add new IPv4 port mapping. Type in the name for the port forwarding entry. Choose the protocol TCP or UDP or TCP slash UDP. Type in the WAN port and LAN port. Once you start typing the destination IP, a drop-down menu will appear listing all devices on the local network. Select the device or IP address for which you want to configure the port forwarding entry. Click on the plus sign under Destination MAC to add the port forwarding entry. The Destination MAC will populate itself automatically. If the Destination MAC is not populated, the port forwarding entry will not work. Click on the close button to return to the modem's homepage.